Hey, self-made athletes, welcome back to another session with me on our 45 day long fitness journey. And we are halfway there. And what a journey it's been so far. Let me know in the comments section below how you're getting on or if there are topics outside of these workouts that you want me to talk more about and be happy to share. Hey guys, this is Mason from Self Made Athletes and on this channel, I like to do health and nutrition tips, supplement and health product reviews, as well as workout videos just like this one. So if you're looking to level up your health, make sure you subscribe and turn on your notifications so you know when the next video is out. Another new workout to be excited about today, we are doing a resistance-based workout called GOAT. This workout will use agonist and antagonist resistance, and it's just a fancy word to describe how uh, one muscle contracts uh, as the other relaxes and lengthens during our movements. If you've got a workout buddy, grab them, let's get started. It's gonna be a lot more fun because there's gonna be some partner workouts going on today. We've got 15 exercises in total. Pod one and two have three combo exercises, so a total of six each. And the timing here is lap number one, 60 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, and uh, it's gonna be for each combo set. Lap number two will be 30 seconds of work with 10 seconds of rest. And then for pod three, we have three body weight exercises. We're gonna be doing four laps. Laps one and two are gonna be 60 seconds of work with 20 seconds of rest. And lap three and four are gonna be 30 seconds of work, uh, 10 seconds of rest. And don't worry if this is confusing now. I know, I get it. It's all gonna make sense when we actually do the workout together. And for today's workout, you're gonna need a booty activation band, some dumbbells. We're going medium or heavy weights today to build those legs. I'm gonna be using eight kg and 15 kg respectively, but make sure you pick an appropriate weight that you're comfortable with lifting. Here's what we're gonna be doing today. Exercise 1A is a dumbbell single leg deadlift. Exercise 1B, Dumbbell Alternate Forward Lunge. Exercise 2A, Dumbbell Sumo Deadlift with a tempo of 401. Exercise 2B, Dumbbell Alternate Reverse Lunge with a Pause. Exercise 3A is Dumbbell Goblet Staggered Squat with a tempo of 401. Exercise 3B, single leg hip thrust hold, plus a calf raise. Exercise 4A is dumbbell lateral lunges. Four B, squat pulse. Five A, glute bridge walkout. Five B, dumbbell shoulder press static lunge. 6A, banded glute activation squat. 6B, dumbbell pickup squat. 7, sumo squat stomp. 8, 10 bicycle kicks and two sit-ups with the twist. 9, low plank diagonal reach.
All right, as you can tell, there is a lot of leg work today and seems like there's quite a bit of lunging. So get ready, let's get made. All right, guys, we're getting ready. Warm up as usual. 15 seconds, make sure you've got your water, your towel close by. We are getting ready in 10 seconds. All right, shake things off. Do your own thing if you need. Hopefully you guys can hear me. I'm gonna project my voice so you guys can hear me. I know the mic's kind of far away. We're gonna start things off with eight steps. Going into frog squats. Lumbar stretch, lying down on the floor. Prisoner squats. Lumbar stretch. Shake it off. We're getting ready in 20 seconds. We're gonna get this party started. Hopefully as I come closer, you guys can hear me a bit better. I do apologize once again. My audio has broken on me, so I've just got a simple boom mic. So it's really far away. I'll try to project my voice. First thing that we're doing is a single leg deadlift. Go ahead and pick up your weights. Okay, keep one foot grounded, the other foot off the ground. Let the weights carry you forward. Dropping your upper body. Leaning forward and then kicking your rear foot back. You're gonna do it a couple times. Maybe we'll switch at the halfway mark. Remember, it's a minute of work here. What's important is to keep your chest up, your shoulder blades back so that your uh, your back isn't rounding on you. Okay, so I'm gonna switch sides. You can too if you'd like. We don't want this. Look at that. Shoulders turning in, back completely rounded. Keep your chest up, back straight. Down on the list to see what exercise is next. 
in those combos so that you guys can switch in between. If not, just do it together. Just do it with me. It's all good. Good. As you step forward into the lunge, please do not lean into the lunge. Okay? Just step forward. Center of gravity of your body should go straight down. a sumo deadlift at a tempo of four zero one that means we're going four seconds down one second up sumo outside of shoulder width I'm gonna go heavy let's go heavy weights Ooh, yeah. all right pushing the bum backwards once again the upper body leaning forward chest up back straight let the weight carry you forward as you come up, big squeeze of the glutes. No need to bend the knees too much. We are not squatting, it's a deadlift. So on the side, this is what it looks like. Push the bum back. Keep this back straight. Reverse lunge with a pause at the bottom. Three, two, one. Here we go. Pause and up. Give me one count at the bottom there. Okay, here we go. Right this way, hope you guys can see me. So 
So, single leg, hip thrust, calf raise. Look at that, right there. The calf, heel comes back down, hips come back down. Leg stays in the air, up, calf, down, down. One more. to rest there. All right. Next up, we're doing goblet staggered squat. Grab your weight. Here we go. Woo! 
right, guys, we get a full minute break here. Take some rest, wipe off your sweat, grab some water, shake off those legs. I know they're burning. We're gonna be right back. Another 40 seconds or so to go. Lots of leg work today. Make sure you stretch if you're feeling a bit tight. All right. In less than a minute, or 30 seconds I should say, the first exercise that we're doing is a dumbbell lateral lunge. You're gonna hold two weights, and as you lunge off to the side, one's gonna be on the outside of the leg, one's gonna be on the inside of the leg, all right? I'm actually gonna use my medium weights at 8 kg. 15 might be a little bit too much. All right, here we go. Find some space, step off to the side, drop or bend the knee, drop the weights beside uh, or on each side of the knee, I should say, okay? You gotta step right off to the side, guys. Point your toes facing me, facing forward. feel like it we're doing squat pulses staying nice and low in our squat about 90 degrees pulsing for a minute is gonna burn here we go three two one let's work now like I said if you want add your weight throw it here in front of you you've also got an activation band on the side if you feel like this is too easy it's working just for me smashing it okay next up we're doing a glute bridge walkout so we're gonna come down onto a glute bridge position and we're gonna walk our feet outwards here we go glute bridge walk the feet out keep the hips high and walk back into your glute bridge next one is gonna be a hard exercise you're gonna hold yourself in a lunge position and we're gonna do shoulder presses okay I got my medium weights here we go we're 
Now, you can do double shoulder press like this, or you can do singles. Absolutely up to you. Make sure that you're not just in a step back like this. Okay, you wanna bend that knee. Switch sides. Next up, we're doing banded glute activation squats. Put the activation band around your knees, just above. We're gonna go into a squat, pulse, and then come up, ready? Okay, squat, push your knees out, and stand tall. Now, as you push your knees outwards, try your best not to turn your ankles or your feet, just the knees are moving. Okay? Control, 30 seconds left. up squat essentially I want you to imagine you're picking up something in front of you but you gotta squat down drop your bum down to, to pick up the weight okay so we got two dumbbells here we go squatting down and up that's it that's the move okay so on the side squatting down and up just imagine these dumbbells is a box or your baby or something that you need to pick up. If you pick it up like this, chances are you're gonna hurt your back. Come down, drop your bum down, use your legs. exercises or the three combo sets we're just gonna repeat that with only 30 seconds of work okay dumbbell lateral uh, lunges first get ready three two one here we go Three. 
three, two, one, and rest. Oh my goodness. All right, next up, boot bridge walkouts. Lie down on the floor. sip of water. I'm going to be right back. All right, next pod. If it was confusing to you when I explained it earlier, hopefully it's going to make a little bit more sense as we do this right now, but I'm just going to recap. We've got three body weight exercises. We're doing four laps. The first two laps are going to be a minute long in terms of our, our working cycle and then uh, 20 seconds rest. The third and fourth lap are gonna be 30 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, okay? So, if you got a yoga mat, use that because we're gonna be holding ourselves in a low plank position. If not, you can use a cushion. If you feel like your elbows hurt, placing it on hardwood or cement or anything like that, okay? First thing that we're doing, sumo frog stomps. All right, here we go. Coming down into sumo squat position and just stomping away. One side after the other. You do not need to stomp loud like I am. You can go softly. Okay, you just need to stay low. Low. Feel the legs burn. Woo. We've got the 10 bicycle kicks and two sit up with a twist, okay? So bicycle kicks, opposite elbow to opposite knee, and then we're gonna sit all the way up and add a twist. Here we go. Sit 
sitting up. Elbow to the opposite side of the, of the knee on the outside. diagonal reach so opposite hand opposite foot will touch outwards come back into your plank outwards come back in okay here we go one full minute here a minute each we're going back into our stomps sumo squat style three two one here we go stay low feeling right now I feel the same way Woo! all right next up next up we've got those bicycle kicks Uh, reach 
in the low plank position. We're getting ready. Three, two, one, here we go. done everyone all right third lap and fourth lap same three exercises less timing okay so we're cutting the work in half only 30 seconds of work but only 10 seconds of rest we're getting ready in our stops here we go round left about a minute and 30 seconds we got this take a deep breath reset stomping away here we go stay low stay low this is it guys last lap hang in there And rest, all right, set up. Bicycle kicks and sit up twist. Three, two, one, go. Five seconds, three, two, one. 
Give yourself a pat on the back. That was GOAT. You are the greatest of all time from what you were trying or what you were yesterday and where you're trying to go. Guys, I can't appreciate your patience with me. I do know that there's in and outs with the audio. I do know some of the video cuts off early. Thank you for being patient. Thank you for continuously supporting as I, you know, I've done a series of this, but I'm still very new to recording myself. And um, I do appreciate uh, everyone who's shown some love, leaving comments, letting me know uh, what I can do better and things like that. I am trying my best. Thank you so much for all of your support. We are in another heavy cardio workout tomorrow and it's gonna be a new workout. It doesn't come up very often. It's supposed to be surfer inspired. It's gonna be a lot of body weight. I can't wait to meet you guys in tomorrow's workout. But for now, give your legs a rest. Make sure you stretch them out. They're a little bit shaky after today's workout. But until then, peace.